your eyes real quick. Let everybody just close their eyes. You've been wanting to be a cop for, let's say, about your whole life. And you, that day, you get sworn in on a Friday, good Friday. You, 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 the first day Monday. Now, everybody, open your eyes. That first day, you get killed by this nigga. Yeah, got all my ass, put the rats in the safe. Where the scale? I'm back trapping the day. I'm getting back in the action the day. I can't see these little niggas, the rats in the way. Uh, can't see these little niggas, the rats in the way. Uh, can't see these little niggas, the rats in the way. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. Do I ever? But, what do I usually be saying? This, I don't know, but look, this is some serious shit, bro. Like, serious, bro. Whatever I be saying is not that. But look, Virginia cop. I won't get mad today. Virginia cop shot dead on her first day on the job, my nigga. God damn, nigga, the first day? Let me find out y'all Virginia niggas is out there, god damn. Shit. The young police officer is being remembered tonight. She was... I know we was all thinking this shit. If y'all watch Raising Canaan, why does she look like... Why does she look like Malcolm Partner? Serious video. This is a serious video, bro. Come on. During her first day on the job, following an awful series of events in Virginia, Jimmy is a Saint Diego. Prince William County, Virginia Police Department posted this picture of rookie officer Ashley Gwinden about to start her first shift. The caption: "Be safe, Chief Steve Hudson." She was literally sworn in uh, the day before on Friday. Before becoming a U.S. Marine reservist, she interned for the police department. She clearly had a passion to serve others in a way that went beyond uh, herself. Gwyndon and two other officers responded to a domestic disturbance on Saturday. When they arrived, suspect Ronald Hamilton opened fire from... Oh, no. Nah. Just so, just, everybody, just do me, just do me one favor. Just, just close your eyes real quick. Let everybody just close their eyes. You've been wanting to be a cop for, let's say, about your whole life. And you, that day, you get sworn in. On a Friday, good Friday, you, 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 the first day Monday. Now, everybody, open your eyes. That first day, you get killed by this nigga. We have three officers that have been shot. Gwyndon's training officer and 10-year veteran David McCowan, God, along with 8-year veteran Jesse Hempen, were wounded and are expected to survive. Officers provided first aid to the wounded officers until fire and rescue staff could get on scene. Later in the afternoon, Officer Gwyndon succumbed to her injuries. Hamilton eventually surrendered. Police found his wife dead inside the home. The couple has Damn. an 11-year-old son. This nigga. Oh, Jesus Christ, my nigga. R.I.P. her. No doubt about it. Should have never happened. But, God damn, can we get a motherfucking origin on the nigga? This nigga last day out is crazy. Hamilton is an active-duty staff sergeant who works at the Pentagon. 
No one knows why he fired on the officers. Neighbor Leon Harris described Hamilton as a gentle giant. The guy, um, he was a good guy. Great neighbors, you know, just something must have snapped. Early Sunday morning, more than 100 patrol cars lined up outside the hospital where Officer Grindon was taken. They provided escort to a young woman whose first day on the job tragically became her last. Hamilton is expected to be in court tomorrow. He faces one count of capital murder of a police officer and is being held without bond. And Jeff, the county attorney, says he will Boy. take the death penalty. They finna throw this nigga under the jail. Holy shit, bro. God damn, bro. Damn, nigga. Such a short video. Leaves me so speechless. But anyways, y'all let me know what to react to next, man. R.I.P. girl. Y'all let me know, like. <laughs> man, I'm out this bit, man. Let me know what to react to next, man.